Cody, another tough, uh, another tough match up there. Really, you had your opportunities. It was just one of those nights you just couldn't take them. Yeah. Um, oh, Sam, Sam's a good player, and I'm glad I kept up with him. Well, not only kept up with him, um, beautiful 122 checkout. Uh, probably not a lot of people would have gone 54, 54, double seven. But um, you, you seem to just have that automatically in your head. That's the way you were going, and, and you pulled it off perfectly. Yeah, I was just just winning nice. I was just hoping a lot more would have winning. <laughs> it was like you had, I had my shots and just missed the opportunities. But you know, you got to take them when you got them. Well, a couple of times you went out on double seven. I mean, that's not everybody's favourite uh, cup of tea when it comes to a double. Uh, no, it's not. But I ended up on it and. So I was on 28 and then had to go to 14 and I uh, just hit it, same size as every other. So. So every, every TV tournament and appearance, uh, you're looking far more relaxed, far more comfortable up on stage. You know you can, you can live with the big boys when you're, when you're on your A game. Um, much more to come in the future, obviously. Yeah, yeah. Well, um, when I first went on stage, I could hear my own heartbeat. That's how freaky I was feeling. But now, yeah, I am feeling a lot more comfortable up there. Well, your heartbeat, that, that would have been about the loudest part of you. But, of course, we're going to see you again on the stage in Melbourne. Um, so will you do anything different between now and then for how you prepared for this tournament or just go about things the same way? Yeah, no, I'm not going to change a thing. I'm just, I'm just going for it, and if it's working, it's working. And I'm just looking forward to next week, nice and warm, ready for it. So, yeah, bring it on. Well, great game again tonight, mate, and uh, we'll look forward to watching you in Melbourne. All yeah. the best. Thanks, sir.